Hello my coffee cakes and welcome to my last ever subscription unboxing on this channel. Today we're going to find out where we're going. Um, it's our last voyage with Snack Crate and all the subscription boxes on this channel. So let's see where we're going. Welcome to another subscription unboxing on my channel. It is the last one. And why is that? It is because I don't want to go bankrupt doing YouTube and um, these videos just are not very popular and I'm getting loaded up with stuff that I don't really need. And yes, we do eat everything from the snack crate. I'm just not gonna do it because there's plenty of you know, snacks from the store here. Um, so this month we are going to Israel. Wow, this will be great. I can't wait to see. All right, so here is, oh, okay. Oops, so this month we don't have a card. Uh, uh, so this month we explore Israel, welcome. A densely populated country on the eastern shore of the Mediterranean Sea. Israel is the only country in the world to be an officially uh, Jewish state. After the Holocaust in World War II, uh, pressure grew for the international recognition of a Jewish state, and in 1948, Israel declared its independence following the United Nations vote to partition Palestine. Much of the history of the area since that has been one of conflict between Israel on one side and the Palestine Liberation Organization and Israel's Arab neighbors uh, on the other. Hundreds of thousands of Palestinians were displaced in the 1948 conflict and Israel lost 1% of its population. The result was a series of uneasy armistices and continued skirmishes that continue to this day from its roots as an agri agrarian state founded on collectivist principles Israel has blossomed into a high-tech powerhouse in the Middle East and a major force of influence on the global stage. Since 1948, immigrants from around the globe have flocked to the country, leading the melting pot of ethnicities and cultural backgrounds. This diversity has made Israel a vibrant uh, and ever-evolving nation that simultaneously embraces change while keeping alive the traditional values on which the country was founded. Home to iconic states such as the majestic Jordan River and the mysterious Dead Sea. Okay, cool. Fun facts though. Israel is the only country in the world that has more fit trees today than it had 50 years ago. Coffee and cafes are so good in Israel that it's the only country where Starbucks failed trying to break into the local market. Israel has the world's highest rate of universities degrees, uh, university degrees on per capita basis. The Mount of Olives in Jerusalem is the world's oldest continuously used cemetery and pet lovers in uh, Israel created the first ever US cable channel for dogs. Wow! It is scientifically programmed to keep dogs entertained and comforted while they are home alone. Wow, that's pretty cool. All right, so here is our our card for our box. Now we didn't get the mini. There is three tiers of this box. The first one is the the, the mini, which is I believe thirteen ninety nine, and then we got the original, which is twenty six ninety nine. But again, this this is it, guys. We are not doing this anymore. It's just too expensive, and we can't do it. So let's jump into this. So the first thing I see here is a Bisley Bisley. Falafel. Falafel. I like falafels, by the way. Uh, get the taste of Israel's favorite dish in crispy noodle form. Mm. These crunchy snacks will satisfy your munchies with their texture addicting, their, their addicting texture. 
Ooh, that sounds interesting. And then there is, flip it over. We have Bomba Peanut Butter Puffs. I've actually heard of these before. I've not tried these, but I think this might be our um, mukbang in this video. Here it is, Bomba uh, Peanut Puffs. A delicious peanut flavored puff corn snack that is highly regarded all over Israel. They melt in your mouth with every bite. Hmm, that sounds really great. And then the next thing here is, uh, I guess it's the same company. Okay, this is the Bisley. Bisley's Sweet Snack. Uh, Weedy snacks with the flavor louder than their crunch. With the flavors such as barbecue and smoky, these will take your taste buds on a zesty trip. Sounds great. And then, there seems to be a lot from the same brand, which I like that. Here we go, this is called, uh, I think this is Click, Click Bites. Click Bites? These are Click Bites, okay. These tasty bite-sized treats are often given to well-behaved Israeli children. We have them included either Karyot, Cornflake Cookie Variety, Cornflake Cookie Varieties. They are all equally delicious, and this is the cookie. So we got the cookie one. All right. Uh, let's see. Oh, these are really cool. These are oodles. These are oodles. They look like nerds. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, how cute. Okay. They're very cute. The packaging is very cute. These are called oodles. Oh, there's three different ones here. Uh, these sweet, tiny, ball-shaped fruit chews are popular throughout Israel. We've included a few of our favorite flavors for you to try. And there is, looks like an apple, green apple. There's a mix. And blue raspberry. Hmm. All right. On this uh, side of the... Uh, okay, there is also a chocolate log. This here is a chocolate log. Uh, these small chocolate bars are made using a special technique that gives them the appearance of real wooden logs. Now that's something. And then there is a Cleek Choco Kid. This candy bar is made of, of silky milk chocolate mixed together with crunchy bits of puff rice. This confection's texture is definitely something to call home about. Ooh, that does sound interesting. And then there is, I know that um, Hanukkah just passed, um, but I wonder if that's the reason why they gave us this for Passover. No, it's Hanukkah, not Passover, I apologize. Um, so there is a couple bags of chocolate coins. The sweetest currency you can find, these foil wrapped chocolates are a tra traditional gift during Hanukkah and uh, Hanukkah just passed. So that's a cool thing. And I'm gonna flip this over again. Okay, the first thing I see here is a Pisik Zaman. This popular treat features crisp and airy wafers filled with luscious hazelnut cream, ooh, then dipped in milk chocolate. So this is probably like a um, like a Kit Kat bar with a hazelnut. Mmm, okay. And then there's the last, there's a few things left. Here is another brand from this brand, Click, Click in Milk Cream. A sweet crispy bar filled with decadent creamy milk then coated with a generous layer of white and milk chocolate. Okay, that sounds really good. I guess this Click brand is very popular. Click and Bisley. And then lastly, there is a hand, handful of Fluffy Tuffy. This is Fluffy Tuffy. Fluffy Tuffy. Fluffy Tuffy, chewy taffies come in several different tangy, fruity, flavors the intense and aromatic flavors set these candies apart from them all wow that's awesome this actually sounds like a really good box this month it does make it kind of bittersweet that this is the last one but unfortunately like i said um i can't go bankrupt doing youtube and i need to move on to different things um uh, miss kelly's retro kitchen will probably come back in full force maybe a weekly video instead of a bi-weekly one we shall see and now we're on to the mukbang part of this video. And I think I'm going to try out these Bamba. Because I, like I said, I've heard of these before. And I think I, I feel like they've sold them here somewhere. 
but um, I guess we'll give it a shot. Hopefully they're good, as good as it sounds. I'm not sure how I feel about a peanut butter doodle. Oh yeah, they definitely have a very big peanut buttery smell. All right, you ready? Who's ready? Here, would you like a bite? Look at that. Ooh. Now, is it gonna be like a uh, Captain Crunch peanut butter cereal or is it gonna be like a cheese doodle but peanut butter flavor? Let's see. Oh. Definitely like a cheese doodle consistency. And they are very right. These do melt in your mouth. Ooh, that's weird. But it's not bad. Ooh, let me have another one. You want another one? Would you like another? Here you go, darling. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed this last ever unboxing video on my channel. There will be unboxing videos on my channel, just not subscription boxes, if anything. We may keep up with the wish hauls and um, that's probably about it. But remember, kindness is free, so spread that. Not cooties, social distance, and wear your mask. And I'll see you later, my coffee cakes. Happy New Year!